how to add a PayPal button to your Shopify website. Now, this method works on any theme. It is super, super easy. Like you don't have to code or start editing the code of your Shopify site like I have seen in a lot of these other videos. It is the easiest method to do this. So if you follow along by the end of this video, you will be able to add a PayPal button to your Shopify website. Okay, so as I said, this works on any theme. Just open up your Shopify editor right here so that we can go ahead and make changes. And as soon as you have done that, all you need to do is go to the first link in this video description, and that will take you over to this website called Elfsight. Now, Elfsight is absolutely fantastic, and it makes adding certain add-ons or widgets to your Shopify store very, very simple. And the awesome thing is, you can actually get started for free. So all you need to do is enter your email in right here, click on start, and then you can go through and create your account. Now, once you have signed up to Elfsight, all we need to do is click on widgets right here. And you can see these are all of the possible widgets that you can use with Elfsight. So there's a lot of these that you can potentially go and play around with later. However, we are specifically looking for the PayPal button. So go ahead and type in PayPal into this search box. And as you can see, it pops up right here. So all we need to do is click into this. And as you can see, this is like a working PayPal button. You could go ahead and click on this and you basically would set it up right here. Once it's linked to your account, as I said, people will be able to click on this and then they'll be able to go through. It's then going to take you through to this screen right here where we have three options of a template. You can choose like a donation button, a subscribe button, or a buy now button. So go ahead and choose one of these and then we can continue with this template. I should also mention that you can fully customize these. So once again, you can change this to like a donation, a subscription, um, and then you can go ahead and change the text and everything like that. Now, the most important thing is this seller PayPal email right here. So you can only use a business PayPal account. Of course, if you are selling things on your Shopify store, you should have this anyway. So just go ahead and enter in the, your PayPal email that you would like to be paid into right here. Once that is done, we can start filling out the rest of this. So if I just say that this is, um, I don't know, a candle, you can enter that in there. You can choose the currency that this is in or the localization, sorry. Then you can choose the currency. You can choose the price. So I can be like 299. The shipping price, if there's a tax. And then you can also choose the redirect URL where you would send people to after they have made the purchase. Once all of that is done, once you are happy with how this looks and the functionality, all you need to do is click on add to website. This is then going to save the widget and give you like a preview of how this is going to look. And then all we need to do for some reason, this says published up here. You should have a green button that says publish that you can go ahead and click. <laughs> there we go. So just click on publish right here. And then what it is going to do is take you through to this screen. And then what it is going to do is it's going to ask you to pick a plan. So with these plans, the way that it works is it's based on how many monthly website views you get. So you can go ahead and pick one of these plans. However, if you're new to Shopify or if you just want to test this out, you can go for the free version, which is completely free. So go ahead and choose one of these. And as soon as you have selected a plan, it's then going to take you through to here where it gives you a little bit of code. With this code, all we need to do is it's literally as simple as copy and paste. So we copy the code right here, go over to Shopify. Then as you can see, we have the header and footer. Make sure it's not in any of these sections. We want it to be in the template. So not header, not footer, make sure it's in the template. We can then add section. And then from all of these options that come up, just go down to this one that's called custom liquid right here, add this in. And then all we have to do in this liquid code box is simply paste in the code that we just copied. Give it a few seconds to load in. If for whatever reason it isn't loading in instantly, just go ahead and save the site right here. And as soon as you do that, it should go ahead and load in. And that is how you can add a PayPal button to your Shopify website.